For demonstrating better UI, I prepared this little scene with some text, a background and three buttons. Let's check out the tools Better UI comes with. Go to Tools, Better UI, and there we have some tools. Uh, so let's start from below, pick resolution. It's a little window uh, where you can select the l resolution, the same as here, but uh, just with, with a little click. You can put it wherever you want, for example, below the um, games uh, view. Then you just click and the resolution ch changes. As you already see, we have a problem with this UI and we will uh, going to fix this. So what we have to do first, uh, let's go to better UI. Um, okay, first align and distribute. Let's align these uh, buttons here. It annoys me a bit. So we can align it in the middle or let's just do it again uh, through the top or bottom. So, okay. I like it like this and then we make sure, for example, if I move this a little bit away, okay, align again and then distribute. So everything is kind of uh, having the same distances in between. I put this over here. Okay, that's good, but th that didn't fix our problem we had before when we want uh, we change the resolution so let's uh, do this with a snap anchors and with this tool we can easily snap the anchors so you see this text field is anchored here in the middle and if i click this button it's anchored here so let's change the resolution to see what happens okay not much because the background is kind of uh, most important here the panel so this is anchored here when I click here it's anchored on the outside or on the corner of the screen and I change the resolution again and you see it stays where it should of course it scales a bit the rest but we will fix this in a second so let's do it for everything we have just select everything and click this button and now we see they are all anchored correctly. Wonderful. Now we have a much better view. Of course, we have the problem that the font size is not scaling with us. So let's t fix the text problem. Here we have a text component with all this text inside. Uh, I copy it quickly and remove uh, this one and add instead the better text. So here we have um, better UI and controls. And there we have uh, like everything we have also in normal UI, but in the better version, we also have some other things we uh, want to use for uh, creating UIs, also the layouting options, uh, there are better, better versions of it. Uh, but for now, let's go to better text. I paste it again here. So, um, so we have here now a current size and an optimized size, and this is actually what what is changing. Uh, also, we have the stay and bound size, so it uh, only shrinks, not grows. Let's make it uh, black again. So, okay, and uh, we can define how we want to modify the size. Like uh, our current um, optimized resolution is full HD, and yeah, I I think we we wanted something like this. Perfect. Let's say fifty. Okay, this is uh, one w uh, way you could use the better components, but the another way is uh, just right click on the text and make it better. Let's see what how it looks in a different resolution. You see, this and this already changed, the others I didn't replace, and it looks pretty good for the already re replaced ones. Can also uh, select both of these and just right click here and make it better. And now 
we are good. Everything looks good. Okay, let's make this responsive. So we want to make this uh, in portrait mode, but also want to support uh, landscape mode like this, but uh, this doesn't look quite good right now. So let's see that we can support uh, both orientations. Uh, we select the resolution monitor and we see by default we have a fallback for portrait and a landscape screen configuration in addition. Uh, you can of course change it to make sure you have a uh, optimized resolution here for your portrait resolutions also in portrait mode and here in landscape mode meaning that the width the x is more than the height for landscape and other way around for portrait you can also add other screen configurations or change them for example you can ma uh, support only certain sizes of the, the screen or aspect ratios or check uh, special devices like the touch screen or something uh, but for us landscape and uh, portrait is enough for now okay so what we want to do is putting this all on the right side of the screen instead on the bottom side so let's return to a portrait mode I select the panel and then we need a better locator. Right click on Rec Transform or this uh, gear icon and um, select Add Better Locator. And it will be added here. So now we see we have a portrait mode and it has here the same values as the Rec Transform. And Auto Pull is on. So if I change something, it will automatically be written inside here. If auto pull is not on, I can change it manually. And if I change it here, it doesn't change here. But with auto pull, it will immediately change. So let's uh, here on the top right corner we have a um, plus button, and we can add here the landscape mode. When we change now to landscape resolution, make it maybe like this. Okay. Uh, then it landscape is automatically selected and if we change like the rec transform like this and then the landscape auto pulls here portrait is unaffected so I also snap anchors here so we have it for any resolution any landscape resolution and when we switch back to portrait we have it like this so everything in one single scene um, and of course you can do this as well for the buttons for example and let's check it portrait landscape wonderful <laughs> 